What up, game man? Y'all already know who it is. It's your boy vlogging with Greg, and I'm back with another reaction video, man. Back in here with Bugsy Malone, man. This one here is called Men. I'm liking the title of this already, man. This one here sounds like it's gonna be another serious one, bro. I heard the first song I heard of it, it was on uh, what did how did I forgot how you call it? Dub. Dougie something I forgot, <laughs> but hey, the freestyle, bro, it was it was it was bananas, bro. It was it was crazy. So had to come back to him, man, and see what he was talking about. Plus, y'all been telling me to do men. This one, part two and part three, man. So part two and part three is definitely coming, bro. It's definitely coming. So we gonna check out Bugsy Malone, man, with this one here with men, bro. Let's get it. Bugsy Malone. You know? Mr. Snowman on production. Watch this. I got a brand new three bedroom crib with spotlights in the ceiling. It's sick. Got a bean bag in the computer room. All I need now is Grand Theft Auto 06. Got an office and everything cocaine white. In the morning it can get too bright, but it doesn't affect me these days because I've been staying up way too deep in the night thinking about Ooh, before. Oh, we. Got it. I'm say you got everything cocaine white. Even though it be super, like in the morning, it's super bright, but it don't even bother them, man. Don't even bother them, bro. Man, bro. Hey, and this beat, bro. Bro, this, this beat is is totally different. I am not used to this type of beat, but it's clean though. It just sound clean. Moment on production. Watch this. I got a brand new three bedroom crib with spotlights in the ceiling. It's sick. Got a bean bag in the computer room. All I need now is Grand Theft Auto 06. Got an office hey. and everything cocaine white. Mm. In the morning, it can get too bright, but it doesn't affect me these days because I've been staying up way too deep in the night. Thinking uh. about before it all went bad. Before the day I met my real dad. Before I knew about money and bills, and now they both made my mum get sad. So okay. I'm counting about 25 bags. I'm running out of elastic bands because it turns out when you make money on the road, there's nothing you can do with the cash. So I jump in the S line driving. <laughs> See, this is why. This is the reason why I, I I I like this guy from the jump, bro. The way that he tell a story is like you can visualize this and tell. It's almost like you can see him in action as he's telling it, bro. Like he he paints this picture so well, bro. So so well, man. Then my boy said like right when he met his dad. So that let you know right there that he wasn't his daddy wasn't always there. You know what I'm saying? Like he met him later on. Oh, went bad before the day I met my real dad. Before we knew about money and bills, and now they both made my mum get sad. So mm. counting about 25 bags. I'm running out of elastic bands. Cause it turns out when you make money on the road, there's nothing you can do with the cash. So I jump in the S line driving fast. Hoping I'll bump into my stepdad. Cause he say mental abuse is worse than physical abuse when I wanna get him back. But I don't wanna do another custom. Oh wait, hold up. Boy, sound like he on a, <laughs> ah, he about to get some revenge on stepdad, man. Boy, look, that's why they say you got to be careful with who you bring around your kids. You know what I'm saying? Like, you never know what they're doing to them, bro, or what they got on their mind. They might act a certain way around their significant other, but when they gone, bro, ain't no telling what they be doing, man. With the cash, so I jump in the S line driving fast. Hoping I'll bump into my stepdad. Cause he say mental abuse is worse than physical abuse, and I wanna get him back. But I don't wanna do another custodial sentence in a 4 by 4 pad. And I gotta take this time to apologize to my best friend, cause we almost crashed. Let me try and explain it's intricate because I've never been playing. It's intimate because I never contacted a counselor to get rid of this pain. I walk with it and now I'm going insane. Losing control of my own brain. Watching documentaries on serial killers and feeling that I can relate. Did you find that strange? Yeah. Okay, well let me get this straight If I do a life sentence or I don't make it It's cause I could not handle the pain I don't uh. want to hear nobody complain How about that's good talent gone to waste Cause if I didn't go through what I went through Nigga would have never downloaded my mixtapes So let me confirm Exactly Exactly You can't tell nobody something about being Like talent being wasted or Or whatever You don't know what that person actually been through bro You don't know what they been through You don't know what's going through their mind like he said, he can't, he couldn't even think straight. He th he, he watching other documentaries on things that he shouldn't even be think. He shouldn't even be watching at the moment. You know what I'm saying? No, you, nah, you, you can't speak on somebody's life, bro. You don't know what they've been through at all. 
groceries on cereal, kid, as I'm feeling that I can relate. Did you find that strange? Yeah? Okay. Well, let me get this straight. If I do a life sentence or I don't make it, it's cause I could not handle the pain. I don't wanna hear nobody complain. How about that's good talent gone to waste? Cause if I didn't go through what I went through, then you would've never downloaded my mixtape. So let me confide in you. Let me get it off my chest Turns out no matter how many tracks I make I still can't handle the stress But I don't watch hey. all the indirects True say man might see me as a threat I don't mind going out as a legend As long as I'm known as Manchester's best So picture the scene I'm sitting on my yes, corner sir. suffering peace Until I got a call Have you seen yourself in the papers you wanted by the police? And I was like what? And it was hot But do you want to know what was a lot? The night before was the night that I went on Twitter I had a direct message from Sloth Just my look Let me do a Hold on wait what did he say? Take the 31 was excluded out of being insulted. Sitting on my corner, so for in peace until I got a call. Have you seen yourself in the papers you wanted by the police? And I was like, what? And it was hot. But do you want to know what was a lot? The night before was the night that I went on Twitter, I had a direct message from Sloth, just my look. Damn. Let me do a Vincent Van Gogh Cause you know I paint pictures with words And I still not published one book I was in Panacea trying to get to the bar And my man didn't want to let me pass Pushed me into a family of brothers Before you knew it I'd already been crap But let me be my fools into the devil I turn They step back I step forward Play with fire And you're gonna get burned But I must apologise in advance Cause I didn't want it to end so bad See what happened from there was loose I was in the Manchester Evening News It said he got violently attacked Outside in a taxi He was whacked and could've died But that's how you know what the papers tried It was self-defence That's a blatant lie I'm stereotyped And do you Damn. wanna know why? I'm a different guy When I was about eight My mum moved to an area That was heavily white I was in school Looking like Wesley Snipes Ben Sherman's and a <laughs> so, so evidently, he like he said, he grew up in a different area. He wasn't always like this. You know what I'm saying? So something hit him. Something, something attacked him to where it, it, it like he, it was like he was forced to change the way he is. You know what I'm saying? It was self-defense, that's a blatant lie, I'm stereotyped yeah. Do you wanna know why? I'm a different guy When I was about eight, my mom moved to an area that was heavily white I was in school looking like Wesley Snipes, Ben Sherman's in a second hand bike Feeling like a donut cause I'd already been stabbed by the time I was year nine Mom didn't want me to see my side, told me that too many people died Between like 91 and 99 there was a gang war and violent crime My yeah. uncle's face got tore out by the pellets of a shotgun like Frankenstein Dang. I sat with him in an M3 that could do not to 60 in 4.5 one hand holding a stirring wheel Moving quicker than a Batmobile Driving around cheating real when I was about nine Back when the hood was real A villain taking secure local boxes And I don't care if it's hot They don't mean Russell Crowe when they mention The gladiator in the gang war book The first guy that I ever looked up to He was like Batman without the suit and Now it's my turn to try and put money on the map I just hope I can do it like you Hope I Dang Bruh Uncle got His uncle face just <sighs> All this tore off. Man, bro. Woo. That hood life, dog. I'm telling you. <laughs> Local boxes and I don't care if it's hot. They don't mean Russell Crow when they mention the gladiator in the gang war book. The first guy that I ever looked up to, he was like Batman without the suit. And now it's my turn to try and put money on the map. I just hope I can do it like you. Hope mm. I can get one million views. Hope that I never get caught with food. Hope that Charlie can breathe all right in the smoke because I set fire to the booth. And when yeah. I realized the grime was English hip hop, forget about all the tunes. Forget the playlist. I want to go down in history like Toot and Carmoon. Books him along. Leave that play. Hold up, them two names that he just said, the last, two, like, right here. Who Who is them guys? Like, if y'all know them, put them in the comments right quick, man. Playlist, I want to go down in history like T and Kamun. Boots him along. T and Kamun, who is, I don't even, <laughs> I wouldn't even begin to know who that is, bro. But if y'all know them, man, y'all let me know in the comments, though. Because they sound like they, they sound like they were some, some high rollers. Leave that play, bro. I dedicate this one to Dean. My little cousin, you didn't make it. Rest in peace, man. I'll see you soon, my brother. Yo, it's Bugsy Malone. Forget the mixtape for five minutes. We need to delay that because it's something way bigger and way better coming. 0161, money on a fucking map, you boy. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, bro. I like how he rap, dude. Like I said, he stays with a low tone voice. 
his beat, bro, that beat was, hey, it, it, it fit. <laughs> it definitely fit, man, but uh, that was a fire song, dude. It definitely was a fire song, bro. I like them songs that have, like, an actual story with it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's pain behind it. it, it it's, it's always, it's, if it got pain behind it, it, it the song going to make you feel it. You know? So, I liked it, bro. I definitely like it, man. That song that is definitely a banger, man. Shout out to Bugsy Malone on another one, dude. That, yeah. Can't wait to hear the other two. Definitely can't wait to hear the other two. If this one here, and this song was made. It ain't showing it. I think it said like seven years ago, I believe. I think. Yeah, I think it's seven years ago, but hey, bang. Straight up banger, dude. Straight up banger, bro. Can't wait to hear the other two, man. So, y'all go ahead on and hit that like button, man. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You already know who it is, man. It's your boy, Vlog Number Greg, baby. I'm out.